Now, a second demo we can do with this pipeline is show Humanitech's power of dynamic configuration. We defined this pipeline once, and we can now create additional development environments, and they will all use this pipeline. So I can create a new environment, clone it from development. We'll call it, let's say, development two. And if I create that, it's going to prompt me to deploy what was in the first development environment into this one as well. And you see that it's also going to use this pipeline. I can deploy it. It's going to go through the same motions. But now we're deploying to a whole new environment. So this will produce, uh, in this case, it's going to the same Kubernetes cluster, but it'll land up in a different namespace, different DNS name, different ingresses, different everything, and will automatically push the right information down to our uh, GitHub action so that it can run tests against a different environment. So right now it's busy doing that DNS deployment. And once it finishes that, it'll go back to that same wait for readiness step before running our tests. One thing you'll notice is that, and we can confirm it in Humanitech, is that these are two different environments. So if we go to development two, look inside our resource, we've got our DNS here, you'll see we've got a different host name running the same application. So I can go to development one. and it's running a different copy of the same application. Now, same app, same configuration, but a different runtime. So in this case, the color is different. We can expand the, diff the details here and you'll see a different start time and things like that. But that shows how you can write this pipeline once and your developers can use the same pipeline for all their develop development environments without needing to know how to create pipelines or understand how to link it and pass things through. And in that way, it's much more flexible. Since the pipeline is not actually tied to the environment, I can go ahead and delete this environment. And it doesn't affect the ability to deploy anything else in this application. The pipeline still exists at an application level.